Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're going to talk about APRS, and that's the Automatic Packet Reporting System. It's an amateur radio-based system for real-time digital communication of information of immediate value in the local area. You're not going to be transmitting it any great distance. It's only for the local area. So let's take a quick look at that. What you'll have is a radio. It'll be set to 144.390. That's the North America Packet packet frequency and you'll be sending your packets on that frequency and you'll be listening for them and you'll have a radio that will display it. So stay tuned for a bit more fun as we discuss a little bit about APRS. We'd like to ask that you please subscribe, hit the like button, and the notify to stay current with our content. Thank you. Now I'm using a Yaesu FT5D and here's the audio for the radio transmission. So it's not much to listen to. You're listening to a modem as it being applied across the air in FM. But anyway, what you'll see on your radio depends on which one you have, but you'll get things like what station information it was. You'll find out when you transmit, it'll show from DE, and it'll give your call sign. You'll have stations that put out weather for you like this, so you can look right on the screen and see the weather, how far they are away, what kind of rain they've been getting, what their ID number is, what direction they are, and there's a little map there that kind of gives you a hint about where they are in relation to you. Since you do have to have GPS to mark your location, and this uh, particular radio has uh, GPS built in. There's a data packet right there from KE8WFC-8. Now the dash 8 tells you something about what kind of station it is for packet. A dash 9 would be a packet on a FT300 Delta. There's a bunch of dashes for that. We're not going to go into it. That's covered elsewhere. But I just want to just give you a quick feel for it. I'm just starting to dabble in APRS and I have this radio that does it automatically as well as the 300 Delta and the uh, 991 Alpha all by Yezu. But you know it's interesting to play with. It's not hard to get up and running. You just need to have a you know an antenna for it and everything. But you can have a little bit of fun with it and share some information. But you can also have this go on if you're transmitting while you're mobile. It can record your position and people have done that for vehicles and for walking. But you can also use it here for an airplane. A guy uses it, puts out a position report every two minutes, and then at the end of the year he goes, "Well, I had 2,822 two-minute." reports he divides that up and found out that he flew for 94 hours last year based out of butler county airport in ohio and as you can see right there there's all the map of all the places that he flew and all his report points so that's a little bit of fun you can have with aps marking your vehicle as you travel around hope you found all this useful and informative ladies and gentlemen and i look forward to seeing you again thanks for watching